Hello everyone and welcome back to Unreal Gold and welcome to the Dark Arena where there's apparently nothing in the water. That's alright, so let's continue. We've got, ooh, health pack. I'll take that. I can probably use that. And here we have some barrels and a vase, so let's get out our handy handgun and let's see whether we have anything in here. Doesn't look like it, so we've got more faces. And we've got some rather dark spots here. Nope, doesn't really seem to be anything there. So let's see, can we just go through here? No, doesn't seem like it. So I guess we have to push one of these faces again. Yep, here we go. Oh, didn't we? Oh yeah, we do. All right, so let's continue. This is just a block. Yeah, seems to be just a block. So here we have 8-ball ammunition that I don't really need. That's alright though. And we're at the surface again. Look at those beautiful mountains in the background. Yeah, and here we have a rather, rather large open area with some plant life. So let's explore a little bit. Ooh, look at that. Healing plant, I can use that. So far, not a single enemy, interestingly. So let's pop a quick save here and let's get out our machine gun or crystal machine gun or whatever that's, whatever this weapon is actually officially called. And here we have uh, another one of our friends and a massive building with a red flag. Sky looks actually kind of nice though. But before we go there, let's just explore a little bit more. Hmm. So there's a bad guy. Maybe we can ambush him. Let's see. He might have. Might have some goodies. Yeah, there's definitely some good stuff there. So, can I actually hit you from this distance here? Well, not not too well, but you'll also have issues hitting me with your magical balls. So, man, stop stop barrel rolling. Nope, you're not going to get me. Or maybe you are, but at least not. Yeah, there we go. I probably waste a little bit of ammunition here, but we've got healing plants, so I'm all right. I don't think I can take these guys down. It doesn't seem like it. But we got some armor. I appreciate that. It has been a while since we got some armor. And is there anything else here? Maybe there is. There's plant over there. So maybe we can actually... Oh yeah, it looks like there's a passage here. Okay, oh, I picked up the torch. It's nice, and we've got a message here. I escaped from my cell, but I can't find the strength to go on. Remember me to my family. Okay, so it looks like, hmm. Pretty sure we can go through here. Okay, maybe, okay, let's get out the, the big guns. There we go. That's a lot better. So, that's said and done. Let's get out our basic gun. I actually quite like this one. And I guess we should get out our torch. So, here we go. Oh wait, no, that's, that's not what I wanted to do. I want to activate whatever. We've got candles here anyway, so I guess it doesn't really matter too much. So could also use well this is kind of creepy to be honest. Could also use flares, but they're only really good for lighting up one area, not really. Okay, so it goes whoa. whoa, whoa, whoa. You can you scared me, you scared me. You came kind of out of nowhere. And now you're dead. So I guess I'm the scary one after all. Uh, that guy made me jump. Not going to lie. So, let's set and done. Let's just see what else awaits us here. I think I want to explore a little bit before I go through these doors. I can't seem to... To get into any of these cells. Question is whether I even want that. I mean, there's definitely an item there. But generally spoken, 
Hmm. So here we have boiling orange juice and no can't really find anything else here so I guess I'm going to just go through those doors and see whether I can oh look at that so oh you want to hit me that didn't oh you just magic the door so let's see oh you almost got me there almost got me there and now you're dead so got some crystals always going to take the blue tabarium and here we've got the stinger wait did we already have the stinger I guess we do but I guess it doesn't are those switches yeah those are switches so the question is what did that do so we can get upstairs here so maybe hey okay okay so we can get back here is this it's no it doesn't seem to be a door okay maybe that opens some cells who knows um anyway let's see what we have here oh another one of you guys i'm all right with that you just stay down there and throw your magic against the wall. I'm alright with that. There we go. And now you're dead. So... Uh, something tells me I shouldn't push those switches. So here we have decapitated bodies. And here's another, another human. So I guess... I don't know how I can liberate these guys, but I probably don't want to push them into the lava, so let's just not do that. And these guys attract flies really, really fast, especially compared to the guys that definitely have been dead longer. So, anyway, let's explore a little bit more. Oh, wait, did I come through here? I guess I. Yeah, pretty, yeah I, I definitely did, so. Let's just see whether the cells are open or not. It looks like it. Oh, 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 tentacle fork. No wonder the guys in the cells are dead. Those guys around got some bandages. Wow, I, I don't recall having having access to bandages before. I mean, they, they barely heal anything, so I guess it's not that special. Yeah, I should explore all the cells before. But yeah, I guess good for me. So these ones here are still closed, but they don't seem to contain any items anyway, so I guess they're not really of interest. I guess, are those more bandages? If yes, they're probably not terribly interesting. Anything else here? Nope. Just more boiling tomato soup. So, yeah, I mean, to be honest, I'm not quite sure that I'm missing anything super fancy here. Uh, I think I'll just see what we have here. Oh, 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 wow. Can I fall down there? Let's not let's not find out. This just leads back to the prism. Uh, prism, yeah. The prism. The prison. So nothing oh, 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 and more of you. You guys just you just come out of nowhere. So oh yeah, you're not going to get me, but if I if I have room to maneuver, this is actually not too bad. And there we go. Killed mid-jump. As you deserve it. Could use different weapons, but I kind of like this one for the precision. And if I have the space, it's actually quite quite useful in my opinion. So, got the switch here. Got me a cage elevator. Which sounds pretty awesome, I presume. So let's see what we have there. Um, oh, wait. Is it already back, back upstairs again? I guess so. Okay, are we, are we supposed to take it from... Wait. Are we supposed to take that from upstairs? Am I missing something here? I guess we could just jump down, really. 
Yeah, I guess I could definitely do that. Yep. So please take me back up. Thank you very much. So you can barely use this elevator without accidentally breaking your legs. Anyway, this looks... Whoa, another one of you guys. More dark arena like in the other areas. Let's hope there's not another one behind me. Well, in case there's, let's just take a step back. Pop another quick save. And let's see what we have here. This definitely looks like an arena. I've got a switch. Always good, I guess. Or maybe not, because I can't seem to be able to use this one, actually. So is this just a big circle? I think it is. At least it seems like it. Mm -hmm. So I guess we are just going to enter. So here is... I'm not quite sure that I like this. Let's see. Okay. Well, you look, you look, you, you look scary. So what are you, you, you trying to throw some rocks into my face? What the the elf fire on this one here? Oh, it's a it's a grenade launcher. It seems like. So, yeah. Um. Hmm. It doesn't really seem to want to come after me so far. Oh, okay, now he is. Well, I'll take that back. So... How about we just keep this up? And shoot more rockets at his face. No, 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 I think I, I, think I kind of like having this column between you and me. Yeah, that seems like a good idea. Wow, that corpse just got... splintered into pieces. Whoa, and so did I. Wow. Did the guy kill me in one hit? Seems like it, because damn, I'm... I'm Chutney. Well, I guess I'm going to try this again. So, here we are again. Okay, and... Oh, I guess he comes from this direction this time. So, yeah, I'm, let's be a little bit... Oh, now, now he comes after me straight away. That doesn't really make things easier, I guess. So, let's, let's try to avoid him. Let's actually take... A little step back here, or maybe not too much a step back because we kind of want to not get stuck here. And he throws surprisingly fast. I can't seem to be able to lock onto him, for better or worse. Oh yeah, grenade launcher. Whoop. And he can also do some sort of ground storm. Okay, but yeah, I guess the eight ball seems to be the weapon of choice here. His, his ground storm doesn't really seem to be all that bad because he's, you know, jumping a little bit, but it's not like in a classic 2D games where you're just totally paralyzed when that happens. So let's try to avoid this guy. And I mean, do I? I, I guess I'm doing damage because I mean, he's, he seems to be getting angry, and I, I see the like the blood pixels. So I guess that's good for me. Just a slowly strafe and occasionally he turns really black so let's just, let's just keep this up this seems to work rather well because i can't really get hit at all but at least keep like using the comb as a shield seems to work rather well so let's do just that and yeah not face him directly or her maybe it's a female or maybe it's oh it looks like you're dead you ugly bipedal stegosaurus thing. Okay, looks like I won. So, got some healing fruit. I wonder what that's for, because if this guy kills me in one hit, there's no real point in getting that, is there? Anyway, some well-deserved 8-ball ammunition. Yeah, let's actually let's pop a safe right here. So, that guy wasn't too bad. I've been fighting regular enemies that did more damage to me, to be honest. But anyway, let's just quickly stock up on health, which we don't really need. And let's see what we have behind these doors here. Nothing, or at least nothing we can access. So... I guess we're going to move forward here. 
if we could. So there's a pair of doors here, but they don't seem to open. I guess I overlooked a switch. Oh yeah, definitely overlooked the switch here. There we go. Did that unlock these doors as well? Nope, doesn't seem like it. Okay, just to be sure, this one here too. Okay, here we go. Let's try to not get crushed. And looks like that was the end of this level. So thanks for watching. And I shall see you next time. Yeah, looks like we defeated the first boss. Not quite sure how many bosses this game has. I guess there's one final boss. Because otherwise it would be a little bit anticlimactic. But we'll see. For now, thanks for watching. And I shall see you then. Take care and goodbye.